this is a second career for me and usually they they say for a new nurse you should try your hand at different things but I feel like um, my main reason for getting into nursing is to make a difference and this is a great organization to do that. So I get up far too early and make breakfast, commute in from Astoria. Once I get here I do a walk through and see what's going on in the clinic and see what's happening if I can step in and fix anything that needs writing. And then I check my telephone encounters for the day, uh, answer patients' phone calls. There are often a lot of questions, especially uh, around some of the procedures that we do. In addition to just checking in on like, how do I take my medication and send in prescriptions and handle a lot of the pharmacy type work. We actually have fairly frequent meetings um, with all clinical staff that keeps us up to date on the latest research and procedural changes that we make that'll make things better for the patients. I would say a big part of it is listening to the patient and trusting the patient. You know, at the end of the day, this is a person in front of you coming into the health center and they may be scared, they may have been suffering with something for a long time and finally seeking care. Yes, I have all this background, I know what to do for her medically, but at the end of the day I have to relate to her as a human being. So remembering that part is key. After work, I go home and, and cook something that hopefully will take one pot or pan so that I don't have to do a lot of dishes afterwards. And then I settle in to do homework. SPS is very diverse and has a lot of different, not just ethnic backgrounds, but family backgrounds, professional backgrounds. You know, it's not just like 18-year-old kids that are finishing high school and moving into college. It's people who have a little bit of life experience and professional experience and that ends up being a pretty valuable insight into what it takes to be a good nurse. And I think um, having the bachelor's program making you think about the different ways that that full person is experiencing um, their health crisis. Um, that's a big part of what's making that education valuable.